Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today, um, I got sent, uh, these bottles from Vape Wild. Um, I do want to say before we get into this, I didn't purchase these. These were sent to me from Vape Wild for review, but they're not paying me for this, so I'm going to tell you my thoughts on it, on yes or no, if I like them or not. This will be completely unbiased, but I wanted to let you know I, I didn't purchase these. Um, so first up, we've got Hannibal Nectar. We've got Hannibal Nectar. Um, it's a 65-35 blend. It's 3 mgs of nicotine. And this is kind of like a fruit cocktail -y flavor. And then we've got this one, which I actually got in my smaller packages to actually test out. This is Murica. This is supposed to be a red, white, and blue popsicle. And last but not least, this is the S plus C squared. Supposed to be like a strawberry milkshake type flavor. Um, I haven't tried this one yet. I've tried these other two, not on camera, but I've tried these out in my test kit. But uh, So we're going to start off with uh, this one right here. Opening this up for the first time. Um, so I am vaping this on my Vupu Drag Resin Edition. And I'm using the Drop Dead RDA. This is my favorite RDA currently. If you haven't seen my review for that, it's going to be down in the description. It should pop up on a card on one of these sides. So, we do have this. I'm going airflow completely open. 65 watts, 4.95 volts to get this. Let's see what the flavor's like. Okay, right off the bat, um, it's a lot of cream. You, you're, you're getting a lot of that um, that creamy flavor. I'm, I'm guessing that's what the, the S plus C is, is strawberry plus cream. Um, it, it's a lot of cream. You don't really get that strawberry um, right off the bat. It's kind of an after-the-fact flavor. Um, on the exhale, you start tasting the, uh, the strawberries more. But it, it's actually a very good flavor. Um, it kind of coats your mouth in this uh, mixture of like a, a bowl of strawberry ice cream. It's it's actually really enjoyable. It's really good. <clears throat> I do want to go ahead and say I'm not a big fan of uh, like cream flavors, but this one's actually very enjoyable. Um, it does have three milligrams of nicotine, which I'm not used to. I normally don't vape anything with nicotine in it, so. Um, since we're going through three different bottles on this RDA, I might get nicked out kind of quick, but we're going to go on through the rest of them as well. Okay, I'm going to down the wattage to about 50. Um, a lot of times with these uh, special flavors like this, you can get different flavors out of them at different wattages. So uh, we are going to test it at 50. We're doing 4.3 volts to get this. Okay, at 50 watts, there's not a lot of strawberry whatsoever. Um, I'm really getting mostly cream from this at 50 watts. So um, I keep this RDA at about 65. We're going to knock it up to 70, which is kind of my high end for this RDA. I'm not going to go much higher than that. But uh, let's see if we get a little bit more strawberry around that 70 watt mark. Absolutely. Okay, so around the 70 mark, I am getting more of that strawberry flavor. Um, it is the cream to begin with, but then you start getting that strawberry on the exhale. Uh, very good flavor. I, I actually, I'm very surprised. I actually like that. Next up, I'm going to try this Hannibal Nectar. It's supposed to be kind of a uh, orangey pear pineapple. It, it's a little bit of a mix of everything. You can see on the bottle right there. It's got strawberries and blackberries and, I mean, all, all the fruits that you can imagine. Um, so, I do have, uh, this is cotton bacon. 
in here with just two regular Clapton coils pre-made from uh, Coilmaster. Ooh, that already smells good. All right, so let's give this a shot. Uh, we're gonna kick it back down to 65. That's where I keep this RDA. That's where I like it the most at. So let's try out Hannibal Nectar. Wow. Okay, there's a lot of fruit in this uh, in this e juice. Uh, it's it's kind of hard to to pinpoint one. Um, it, it has a lot of orange in it or tangerine. I'll, I'll say that 100%. Uh, let's kick it down to 50 and see what we get from that. 50 watts, 4.3 volts. Okay, that is much more enjoyable at 50 watts. I'm tasting more peach and coconut, uh, if that makes sense. Yeah, there, there is definitely some coconut in there at the 50-watt uh, mark. I, I would say at 50 watts is probably um, where you're going to get the best flavor for the Hannibal Nectar. Uh, I hate to say this, but I actually like the strawberries and cream better, which is kind of crazy because I don't like many cream flavors. But... Uh, I'm not even going to kick this up around 70. I don't see any reason to. I like the flavor here at 50. Okay, guys, for our third flavor, this is Murica. It's supposed to be like the red, white, and blue popsicles that you ate as a child. Or I ate as a child, should I say. Um, so this is going to have um, like cherry and blueberry or blue raspberry and to be honest i'm not exactly sure what the white color is in there uh but hopefully we get some taste uh we're already at 50 watts from the last one so we're going to test it out there at 50 and work our way up to 60 65 70 wherever i feel like it needs to be so this is america at 50 watts Okay, so at 50 watts, it's literally just, it tastes like the whole popsicle right now. I'm not really getting any distinct flavors of like cherry or blue raspberry or whatever the middle one is. I don't know. If you do know, please leave it in the comments down below because I don't know what that is. Okay, so we're going to kick it up to 65 and see if I can see any distinct different flavors from this. So 65 watts. Okay, at, at 65 watts, I'm definitely tasting cherry. Uh, it, it seems to be the predominant note in this. On, on the exhale, you are getting kind of that blue rasp, and there's something else in there I can't quite put my finger on. 70. Wow, that's a really warm vape right there at 70. Okay, so at 70, I'm definitely getting a mix of cherry and blue raspberry, but there's something else in there, and I, I can't put my finger on what it is, but it's really good. It's probably my favorite out of the three that Vape Wild sent me. Uh, so if I had to put them in order, I would probably go... America first, then the strawberries and cream, and then the Hannibal Nectar. It's just a strange name, Hannibal Nectar. But yeah, guys, that is the three different flavors that I got sent from Vape Wild. If you would like to check them out, they have a welcome code. Uh, you just go down to their website. It'll be linked down in the box below. You just uh, sign up with an email, put in welcome10, and you're going to get 13 different flavors sent to you for a dollar. 
Uh, this is not a sponsored video. They just sent me these for me to review. And uh, they have a lot of different flavors on there that you can choose from, from gourmand flavors to candy flavors uh, to tobacco flavor, everything that you can think of just about. And they're pretty reasonably priced. I think this bottle, it's a 60 ml bottle, I think you get it for about $12, depending on the flavor. Some of them are around $9.99. It's a pretty good deal for these 60 ml Gorilla bottles. Um, you can get them in different nicotines from zero. I think it's uh, three, 12, maybe six or nine in there. Uh, but yeah, guys, think about checking out Vape Wild. And if you like this video anytime, give it a big thumbs up. Think about sticking around, checking out my other channel. It's just Tanner Watson. I'm in the middle of remodeling my office. So I haven't posted very many videos over there, but we'll be done hopefully in the next two or three weeks. And uh, you'll be seeing videos over there. So uh, thanks for coming along. And uh, Keep vaping.